Today, Kevin and I are gonna be trying some different popcorn from Devon's Mackinac Island Popcorn Company. Now, you might recognize the name Devon's um, in Mackinac Island because we have tried a, a large assortment of their fudge and we have more that we're gonna try thanks to Amanda. Amanda sent us a box full of items from Devon's and so we're just thrilled to be getting to try these because we have never seen this popcorn around here. Uh, we have four varieties here but there will be other reviews coming because she sent us I think I have three more bags of popcorn. It was just too much to try for one video so I thought I would split it up. Uh, I have the just the regular caramel corn. I have cashew caramel corn. Yeah, this is the Mackinac blend, which you're not sure what it is 100%. Um, and then we have the Chicago blend, which is usually cheese and um, caramel. caramel corn. Yeah. So uh, we brought the scale in uh, so that you could see, uh, we'll have to scoot it forward, uh, so that you can see how much you get. Um, this is the regular caramel corn. It says Devon's Mackinac Island Popcorn Company uses the finest ingredients to make our one of the kind handcrafted popcorn. When you open a bag, it's no question you will love it guaranteed. Proudly made in Northern Michigan. Crunchy, quality, delicious. This is plain caramel corn, it says. Um, two ounces or 57 grams is 100, 190 calories. The rest of these. Oh, it says what it is. Yeah. Okay. I think the rest of these are the same calories, and this one's the only one that's 190. So we're going for 57 grams. One too many. Oh, two too many. Close enough. There we go. So this is how much you get for 190. I think that's pretty good, actually, of caramel corn. So. That's good caramel corn. It's not too hard. Some caramel corns are really hard. This one's not. And it's so sweet. That's good caramel corn. That's delicious. It rem and the popcorn itself seems to be really good and fresh. That's excellent caramel. I absolutely love that. And it's not overly sweet. <clears throat> and it's it's a really it's just it's a good mix all around. I like how well coated it is. It's well coated so you get that um outer layer of crisp. I love that. It's well coated, but it's not super thick to where it's like this hard coating. Mm -hmm. It's just this a, a, a just thick enough to give you a good crunch. And it's not getting stuck in my teeth either, mm -hmm. which is good. Yeah. Um, That's good. With this, though, I'm going to be honest. I would have to weigh it out like that I or I would be too. tempted to eat the half of the bag. Yeah, I'd have to split it, it up into snack bags or something. Because it is that good that mm -hmm. I could keep eating that. Oh, yeah, you would. Okay, so uh -huh. that was caramel. The next one we have... You can let go. Okay. <laughs> the next one we have is cashew caramel. So, um, it doesn't say um, anything different on the back. Like, there's no description, but it's cashew. I'm sure it's gonna have cashews with the with the caramel. It is uh, 57 grams is 220, and I think all the other ones are that as well. So, it's gonna be. It's going to be the same amount that we just weighed for you a while ago. It's just that it's more calories because it has the uh, cashew. So there's a cashew. So it's going to be stuck to the popcorn like that. Good one. Yeah, they're little pieces. Ooh, Good there's one. another one. There's some. I can taste a little bit of a difference. Mm-hmm. That's good. I mean, either way you go, one or the other, they're, they're both good. I wonder if they make one with pecan, because I think pecan would be really good with that. Because, you know, when you when you take a pecan and you put um, uh, sugar on it anyway, it's mm -hmm. delicious. Yeah. Um, I think that would be really good in this. 
This is basically the caramel corn. It's the same thing. With basically, you get a pieces of pecan here and there. It's cashew. Not all, I mean, cashew. You said pecan. I know, though. I know. Um, <laughs> it's not on every piece, though, so don't expect you to get a huge number of cashews, no. but it adds just enough pet flavor difference to. I think people that buy cashews know that they're very, very expensive. So I think you would know. You're good. I think you would know that you're not going to get like an an abundance of cashews, but, but, but they're there. And there's a, to know. there's a little bit more of a saltiness I come away with that too. Uh, I did too. Just a little bit more. Yeah, I don't know if they did add more salt to it, but it did seem saltier. Yeah, could be it the did. cashews are saltier too. I agree with that. That one it says right, right there what it is. Mackinac blend, it's white cheddar and caramel corn. Yeah, and see, I think this is just cheddar cheese and caramel corn. That's right. Right. So. And so this is 57 grams, 220, and I think that one's going to be the same. It price. is 220. So. White cheddar. White cheddar. I'm going to try a piece of white cheddar. I am too, because we haven't had it yet. Very, very soft. Mm-hmm. That's different, isn't it? Mm-hmm. Because it's so soft. Almost to the point, it almost feels wet. It's not wet, but it no, almost feels like it's because it's that soft. It's wet. <laughs> I don't think I, I'm not used to having popcorn no, that soft. It's very, very soft. But you're gonna eat it with the, the caramel. I love that combination. It definitely has a different texture. I love the combination. I don't recall having that combination before. Mm -mm. It's about some Mackinac mix. <laughs> yeah, and I haven't been to Mac we haven't been to Mackinac Island. Um, that's good. The cheddar is not like like a really strong, punchy white cheddar like some of them we've had. It's a very light no, flavor. No, but I really, really like But the like texture is really good. good and I, I, I like the flavors. I like the texture of it. I mm -hmm. like, because you're not going to just pick up the, you're not going to just pick out the white cheddar. Right. I know I do that with other things, like other mixes that I'll pick out all of one thing, but this isn't meant to be eaten like that. If you're buying this, you're buying it because you want a little bit of this and a little bit of that at the same time. That works for mm -hmm. me. I love it's very that. good. I love the flavor. Um, the white, like Kevin said, it's not strong. It's like, so we have, we've had some really uh, funky, honestly, yeah. funky cheese, white cheddar, and that doesn't have no. any of that. Mm -hmm. um, no, it's good though. It's this good. is the Chicago blend, cheddar cheese and caramel. Same calories as the other one. Um, and we've had other brands of this mix before, so. We'll try the yeah, yeah. Cheese. That cheese is much firmer. And it's much, much stronger. It's very strong cheddar. Mm, I'll a bag of just that cheddar. I know. That's <laughs> what I was wondering. Do, do they make just a bag of cheddar or popcorn? Mm, that's good. Because they could sell just that cheddar. That is a strong cheddar. It if you don't like, like that cheddar cheese flavor, you would not like these. Almost like that stuff in a macaroni and cheese pouch. <laughs> not quite as fake as that, but... No, it does. Like Kraft macaroni and cheese, yeah. the powder. But this, it's also salty. It is salty, but this tastes more like the actual cheese. The Kraft macaroni and cheese pouches don't really taste like cheese. These, these actually mm -hmm. do taste like the cheese. Have we tried them together yet? Mm-hmm. That's good. You know what? That cheese comes forward a lot more than not. Yes. Um... And how does this mix compared with other brands we've had? Um, I can tell you that cheese is stronger than in other brands. Much, much stronger. Yes. Like because the other brands, the you really get more caramel corn than the cheese. Yes. The other brands, the cheese is there, but it's not at the forefront. Mm -hmm. So like once you get it in your mouth with the caramel corn, pretty much all you taste is caramel corn. This you still get all that cheddar because mm -hmm. it it's just, that strong. It just tastes like you've added a sweetness to it. And I like that. I like the I like the mac yeah, and better. better. Yeah, I really do like that. I think that is delicious. Oh, I kind of like this one. Um, 
All of these are such good quality. They are. Really the only one, no, there's really nothing I can say bad about any of them, honestly. What were you gonna say, the only one you wouldn't get? No, the the, the one I would buy, the, I didn't mean buy the only one. But I started wrong. The one, the you one would... I would buy all the time would just be the regular caramel corn. Or um, the cashew one. It counts on, if they're the same price, I'd probably buy the cashew one. Right. Because it had, the, the, like I said, there was a little saltiness there. Mm -hmm. but, um, but if it was more expensive, I would just get the caramel corn. Right. I think um, all of these are uh, very, very high quality. Mm -hmm. They're excellent. And I'm not, not just saying of... that because they sent it to no. us. Uh, because and... we're always honest. Um, I know some companies don't like that, um, but we are always very honest, so we would let you know if we didn't like it. Um, I would totally buy the caramel corn over and over and over again. Though. Um, one thing I've noticed is there's not a lot of the hull, popcorn hull. I haven't gotten any. I haven't got any stuck in my teeth at all. That's no. the skin on the outside of the popcorn. No, I haven't got any. Or sometimes it, it's, it'll get stuck in the back, back of your throat or something like that. No. I, I literally have, they, they use those big puffy not even with the pieces, looking. not even with the pieces that aren't covered in caramel. Yeah, so, so like the white cheddar, I didn't get any holes in that. Or, yeah. or yeah. Look how big that is, and you really get that little piece of skin right there, and that's it. Yeah, there's. I've had no problem with this mm -hmm. at all. It hasn't gotten stuck in my teeth or anything. Um, any of these are excellent quality. I would be happy to get any of them. Um, I think my. My favorite though is just the original caramel corn. Mm -hmm. um, the only one people, other people might have issues with is this cheese might Chicago. be a little too strong for you. Right. Maybe on the, the funky cheese side a little bit. Um, so it's you, just a very, very, very strong cheddar yeah, cheese. Yeah, if you like cheddar cheese, you'll be fine. Like if you get a block of cheddar cheese and slice it and eat a piece, that's what that tastes yeah, like. Yeah, and if you like Kraft macaroni and cheese, that cheese yeah, so you're, it really you're does fine. remind you of that. So, um, so if you're fine with that, you're okay, but just know it is a really strong cheese. Mm -hmm. So thank you yep, very, much very much to Amanda for sending us these. Like I said, we're going to be trying more of this popcorn because she sent us so much that I couldn't fit it all in one video. And I thought, that's a lot of popcorn to try. <laughs> so we will be trying more and we'll, uh, we'll try to remember that, well, our favorite, was your favorite the caramel too? Yeah, well... The cashew one, if it's the same price. Right, that's true. Yeah, see, we don't know how much these cost. I've never seen these around here. Um, so, yeah, it would be interesting to see how much they cost. Uh, but we'll try to remember uh, uh, which one is our favorite for that video and let you know out of all the ones, out of all the popcorn she sent, which is our favorite. So, I hope you enjoyed this video. If you've ever had this brand, if you've seen these in your area. Yeah, where'd you buy it? Where did you where, buy it? Yeah, you know, let where, people where know. <laughs> now, let people know where you saw it. Uh, so they, they, they can look at, uh, look for it and let us know how much you paid for it. So I hope you enjoyed the video and thanks for watching.